Welcome back to the Mobile Fun YouTube channel, where we bring you the latest and greatest accessories for your devices. Today, we're taking a look at six tips and tricks for your Pixel 6 and 6 Pro. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos on the Google Pixel 6. Let's start with one of the most hyped features, Magic Eraser. Now, if you're familiar with Photoshop, this is like the content aware fill feature with a couple of things to make it a little more user friendly. So when you're on the photo, you want to press edit, slide along to tools, then select magic eraser. You then simply roughly draw around the subject you want to remove. Then the phone with the use of AI magnetizes to the object and then it will attempt to remove it. Now, straight off the bat, you can see it's very fast, quicker than Photoshop a lot of the time. However, if you are trying to remove something complex with lots of stuff behind, then you'll just get a mash of the colors and it will look sort of like a water painting. So best to use when the background is consistent. It really works well when it is happy with the background and a fantastic feature in my eyes. Moving on, Google has brought PowerShare to the Pixel phones, a simple but convenient feature for providing some extra juice for your friends or just charging up for earbuds. To enable this, simply swipe down your notification tray, pull down again to see more toggles and click PowerShare. Now just place the wireless charging compatible device on the back of the phone to share your power. Great in a pinch. Number three is screenshots. Now, not just any screenshot. How many times have you taken a screenshot of something and then needed to crop it before sending it. Well, now you won't need to. Press the lock button and volume button down at the same time. Then select capture more and then drag the grid around what you want. Simple. The next feature will definitely make your life easier. How many times have you been entering a password, username, or just something with letters and numbers and had to constantly switch between letters and numbers even though your phone screen's massive? Well, if you had the keyboard up, tap the settings icon, then preferences and flick the toggle for number row on. This will make the number row present at all times so you won't have to switch back and forth anymore. Tip number five is stabilization modes. When on video, next to the capture button, there is a shaky hand. Tap this and you'll have a few different modes to choose from. Standard mode is used for day-to-day -day recording with some added stabilization. Locked mode is perfect for faraway subjects as it will stabilize a lot more, allowing to focus on them easier. Active mode is used for when moving around a lot, like when filming sports and running around. And then finally, cinematic pan is used for smooth pans and movements. But in this mode, no audio will be recorded. The last tip is for those that are new to Android and have just moved across from iPhones. This is how you will add new widgets to your home screen and change your wallpaper, plus a lot more. All you need to do is press and hold down on your home screen in an empty area, then you'll get a host of options to add. You can also change your accent color, which will match your wallpaper to make everything match. A great new addition to Android 12. There you go, our six top tips for your new Google Pixel 6. I hope this helps you set up your new Pixel 6. Please subscribe for more videos from Mobile Fun. Share with anyone you know that's just picked up a new Pixel. Comment below your thoughts on Android 12. And finally, to buy any phone accessories, check out the links in the description.